Let's start by running through the approval process. There are two prongs. The FDA decides whether a booster would be safe and effective, and the CDC decides whether or not to recommend it. So far, the Pfizer booster is the only one that's checked both boxes. A Pfizer booster is approved six months after your second dose for the following people. Those that are 65 and older, those aged 50 to 64 with certain medical conditions, long-term care residents over 18, people 18 to 49 with medical conditions and a doctor's recommendation, and people who live and work in settings with the risk of high exposure. As for Moderna and Johnson & Johnson boosters, they're still waiting on two things. The FDA commissioner, Janet Woodcock, needs to sign off on the recommendations, and the CDC needs to weigh in. But here's what the FDA committee decided for each of those two vaccines. For Moderna recipients, they approved a booster after six months for the following people. Those over 65, people 18 to 64 who are at a high risk of severe COVID-19, and lastly, those 18 to 64 whose frequent institutional or occupational exposure puts them at a high risk of serious COVID complications. We do have um, 19 out of 19 unanimous uh, yes votes. And then there was today's recommendation. An FDA panel recommended boosters for all Johnson & Johnson recipients over 18 two months after that first shot. That FDA panel also discussed vaccine mixing and matching at that meeting, but so far, no decisions have been made on that. With your Verify, I'm Evan Kozlov.